Hello guys, Donald aka Bloodbearer 115 here coming at you today with a playback because I'm currently live streaming this, forgot to hit record. I'm now hitting record so I'm doing a second intro for people who are watching live. For those that are not watching live, you're watching this over on YouTube. Video on demand most likely I'd assume. Um, so yeah, just doing an intro, just talk to the people in Jericho. Um, part 5? Yeah, part 5 I forgot to uh, record yesterday. So hopefully this recording works out and I can just upload that real easy over to um to YouTube tomorrow. If not, then that's gonna be a bit of an issue. We'll see how that goes. In any case, let's get to talking to these people. And Nora, hey, how's it going? Welcome to the stream of the chat. How are you doing on this fine evening? Let's ask about this person. What do you care? Why is everyone so damn rude? Who found this place? Nobody knows anymore. Whoever he was, his body's probably laying somewhere on this boat. <sighs> but you, but you people don't die. Exactly. Well, these guys need spare parts and blue blood. Why hasn't anybody gone to get that? It's not that simple. You can't just go shopping at a cyber life store. Anyway, nobody wants to risk leaving Jericho. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. Well, then I'll just go get the blood. If everyone's going to be too spooked to do it, I don't have a thing in my head. They won't know I'm an android. I just played DBH for 10 hours, and I destroyed every friendship on accident. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, no, that seems like that seems like the way things go. Uh, I'm trying so hard to be friendly with people, and it's just not happening. Whenever I do a second playthrough, I'm just gonna try and be as big of a dick as I can be, like as big of a dick as possible. I'm gonna destroy every every single relationship with every single person. Crate already emptied, but what was in here? Was it guns? I don't know. Looks like kind of like um tomahawks, kind of. <laughs> I don't think it's going to be tomahawks inside of there. Several of Warehouse and Docks, West Terrence Avenue, Detroit, Michigan. Explore Jericho. Find Lucy. The only one that liked me was North. Literally everyone else hated me. North is the girl I was just talking to, right? And how how is your relationships with the people besides Marcus's relationships? Like how how did you fare fare well with, with good old Hank? Um what? They make children androids? That's really I don't I don't know how I feel about that. They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. Children and all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down, but there's never enough. Kick it. Hey, how's so, it going? How Good to see you fun. again. How are you doing on this uh, fine evening? They won't. We're slowly dying out. Yeah, it's not surprising. So, so you guys, okay, so I thought that you guys were more, um, I thought the androids in this game were more stable than they appear to be. I thought that it was more of a, um, they didn't need that much upkeep, uh, but it's, to me this is not like they need a lot more upkeep than I was aware of. Uh, I'm okay, a little stressed, but should be okay soon. Oh, what's, what's stressing you out? Vent to the chat. No, you don't have to if you don't want to. <laughs> uh, it's completely up to you, but I hope that you feel better. Also, I wish I could walk around this steel plating. Thank you. Who are you? Oh my you god. Of dying too. You are a rust bucket. Do you know what happens after death? Yeah, there, bro. Oh. This person's breaking down. No, I don't. Well, I'm about to find out. What's your name? Marcus. Oh yeah, don't don't think communicate through hand touching. Glad to meet you, Marcus. I always forget. I always forget how these androids work. There's so many different androids in media. Oh, 
okay. I tried to have a good friendship with Hank, but he was so mean to me, and then I was angry, so I destroyed our friendship, but I feel bad now. I have to play it again tomorrow. Yeah, I've, I I really want to have a good friendship with Frank, or uh, Frank, with Hank. Uh, it's deteriorating, and it's like kind of like back, going back up, so I'm trying to keep it in the up direction. Uh, I think I think we're friends currently, uh, but hopefully it stays that way, because I, I like Hank. He's probably my favorite NPC. What's the point of lighting a fire? Like, it seems like no one else cares about it being dark in here, so why should you, Marcus? Don't come in here, turn everyone's lights on. You don't pay the electricity bill. You also look pretty rusted out. Not in very good shape, am I? Uh, no, no, you are not. My diagnostic program isn't working. I don't think it would have anything good to say anyway. What happened to you? They tied me to the back of a car. I think they wanted to have fun. I don't want to shut down. No, I, I don't want to shut down. I mean, Marcus escaped from the junkyard or whatever, where they like put all the scrappy, scrappy people. He should have like he should just do a run back there, grab some parts. Uh, See what he can do. I mean, he got out of there okay. You know, presumably a few more times wouldn't, wouldn't end up too bad. Uh, Hank's a great character. I hope your relationship with him stays up too. I like Hank too. He's just a mood. I don't know what was wrong with me this time. Yeah. And then, um, sometimes I think I'm saying something that's going to be positive and then ends up coming out in such the wrong manner. Like, not not how I meant it to. Like, I just see, you just see the one word. You're like, oh, this is going to be this could be a solid thing, a good thing to say. And then when you see the whole, um, the whole, like, sentence come out, you're like, oh, that is not what I meant to say at all. Uh, Daveister, thank you for the host. Much appreciated. Where are you? Are you Lucy? Person I'm supposed to see? Reminds me of Amanda. Are you Lucy? Sit down. Okay, she seems like an oracle of sorts. That's the vibe I'm getting from her. Like an or the Oracle of Delphi. Show me. Lucy! I'll go to bed now. It's 1.30 in my country. Good night. Have a good night, Nora. I hope you sleep tight. Don't let the whatever bugs bite you in your country do such a thing. I'll Don't. Stop the bleeding. Yeah, I just, I ramble. I'm sorry. <laughs> Have a good night, though. Oh, what is she about to do to me? Oh. Thanks for the help. Okay, appreciate it. I thought she was going to stab me. Like, here's the... You you may have escaped, and you are no longer subservient to humans, Drink but this. you now hold our symbol and just, like, stab through the gap. That would have been, been rough. Oh, so you have blue blood. Why are you not giving blue blood to the people who need it? Is there an option to not drink? Because I would like to, to not drink and be like, hey, there's people out there that need it more than me. This is so somber. Give me your hand. Very, very, uh, ordery. Very, very much just ordering me around. You had it all, and you lost it all. You've seen hell, and now hell lives in you. If she freaks me out. Troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. Huh, okay. Propose a plan to Simon. 
Alright, hey there, saw that you were streaming and wanted to say hi. Well, hello, thank you for stopping by, Sydney. How are you doing on this fine evening? Hey, who's Simon? That, this is Simon, right? Simon, I have a plan for you. Simon. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyberlife Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. North! Maybe it's worth a try. Jericho as a whole? I have like a whole Jericho uh, respect repertoire. Okay. I can't think of what word I want to use for that, I'm but in. something like that. Oh, he doesn't. I don't have any rapport with that man. Explore Jericho. Oh, I missed something. No. How dare I miss such a thing? What? Did it... Talk to damaged Andrew. It's probably just another person to talk to. Ah. Okay. Damn. I hate missing things so much. November 6th, 23. I feel like I've been on November 6th for so long. Doing good, not looking forward to going to school tomorrow, but such is life. Yes, it is. Are you in college, high school? What's what schooling okay? is troubling you at the moment? We'll get some help here. How do you know? Oh. Our, okay, just going from rundown car to rundown building. Alright. This is the place. Oh yeah, there was an android that was like, go to this place, uh, the, they'll have shelter for you or whatever, and she was like, that's across town, we need to go somewhere now. That's why we ho hopped on the train, I'm pretty sure. I think, I'm having a kind of hard time keeping up with her story. Who's ha- Hello? Would you like to buy some Girl Scout cookies? Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could have Zlatko. Us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. This Lotko seems like a good, kind-hearted soul. Senior year of high school, college essays aren't very fun. Yeah, see, I, I, have, I have about three years of college under my belt. Taking a break. Uh, and I miss, I wish I was back in high school. I wish I was back in senior year of high school. Some good, good times back then. But now life is so stressful Luther, and difficult. Would you be so kind as to take these ladies I miss such simple times of essays being my biggest issue. Oh. Don't be afraid of our big friend here. Luther God damn! Just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. Oh, Michelle, good to see you again. Welcome Please. to the stream of the chat. How are you doing this fine evening? Make yourselves at home. I'll take some Thin Mints if you're selling cookies. I'm, I'm, par I'm, I'm partial to the... Uh, what are they called? They always have different names. So like the coconut, it's the chocolate coconut ones. That, 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 that's that's my cookie of choice. On the street, he said you could help us. That picture behind him freaks me out. I don't like it. I see. Samoas. Okay, I was gonna say they're like Samoan cookies or something like that. Deviant, huh? What about her? She's human. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Beautiful landscapes. It doesn't Canada not have spaces, androids? Clean air. And no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. Yes, that's... That's exactly what we want. Of course. 
I can help you. But first, we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. She know about the tracker? Follow Ooh. me. Luther, my boy. Samoa's in my region. Thin mints are where it's at, let's be honest. Uh, thin mints are close no, second. But the Samoa's. Those, those are where it's at for me, personally. Right this way? Everything we need is in the basement. I feel like... So my first impression of him is he means well. And he really wants to help people. My second impression is now, like, I'm worried I'm going to have my android kidney stolen in the basement of his massive house. This place and that man. Let's go. I have a bad feeling. Oh, uh, comfort. He's a bit off. Android. <laughs> I think we can trust him. We don't have much of a choice anyway. Hey. Please excuse the mess. Uh, you know, I, I want to peek in here. I need it somewhere discreet for my machines. Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. I don't really... No. no, she'll be all right. I'm not seeing much to really... Ah! Ah, oh, Luther, you massive piece of meat. Well, act circuits, actually. But Jesus, you scared the... Mmm, you scared me. Oh, Zako is a scary dude, in my opinion. Oh, no. Okay. That worries you me. You just stand over there. This is worrisome. Luther just appearing in the camera. How? Yeah, no, that that was terrifying. You. This could be quite unpleasant. Luther's an absolute tank. Yeah, he that he is massive. Uh, oh, can't sleep. I'll watch your stream till I'm tired, so I can sleep. I still have holidays, so my sleep rhythm strange. is is effed up. Oof. Yeah, no, that um, <laughs> have, having the big break. Is, is one of the reasons. Working in uh, that's, that's one of the reasons so I didn't go back to school because I couldn't get my sleep schedule back to a, a decent so, point to actually go to school. Actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? But you said that. Yeah. The people believe what they want. You deviants are so naive. They all come to me expecting me to help them, and I just reset them sell them on or I keep them for my little experiments okay no no I don't want to be reset let me go ah! oh, I forgot about the child uh, lock it up I'll deal with it later Alice Alice no all right wow a deviant that wants to be a mother that's that's so sweet. I'm gonna kill this guy. I'm so deluded. I cannot wait to shoot this man in the head. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. Sterp. No. Reset. Preparing memory wipe. Hey, someone wanna help me? I'm getting kind of dizzy. I think someone slipped me an android roofie. Oh Jesus! Oh my god. Oh no. The same way. Tears and disillusion. Believe me. You're better off being erased and feeling nothing. No more pain. I have no idea what to do here, if anything. Hope's dashed. I almost envy you. Kara! <laughs> Oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like Mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks no! Like Mommy's completely forgotten you. Carl, what <laughs> happened to you? Oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. Did you bite him? <sighs> hey, you stop that. I really want to beat this man. My memory rip is a fifth away th memory Oh Jesus Stop Stop scaring me You are a massive thing Stop 
Someone needs to put a bell on that thing. I've been trying. I've been looking every which way. Cause a short... Yeah, but how am I going to get over there? I don't have a whole lot of time, so... Oh, I have light. Oh, my legs are... Okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot that I have to, like, reposition my myself here. Um... Yeah. I have no idea what that was supposed to accomplish, but alright. Um... I'll kick you. Try and kick it over at the... the thing. Yeah! No, that, that didn't work. Oh no, I'm gonna be reset. Oh no, I don't know what to do. Help! Help! Kara, no! I seriously have no idea what to do. The cables. Reinitialization completed. Memory deleted. No! No! That really went from like 75 to not 75 so fast. Okay. Uh, was I supposed to like look up? Oh, I bet I was supposed to look up, wasn't I? Mm. <sighs> I done messed up. Yes, you were. Ah, <laughs> why am I so bad? Oh, m m what? Mm. What is that supposed to say? Serves Lotko. Help us. Ooh. Us. There's more than one person in here. That's terrifying. Creating monsters for his amusement. But who's the real monster? Look what he did to Oh us. my god. Reminds me of the, the spider uh thing from Toy Story. You must remember who you are. Otherwise, the little one will die. That's why it's so unsettling. Yeah, no, this is super unsettling. This this seems like the equivalent of um the uh the dude who again steals kidneys and whatnot from um Heavy Rain. I think he was stealing kidneys, right? Let the little one die. No, no, do not let the little one die. No, no. I mean, I suppose I'm gonna play it. I don't. I don't know how I'm gonna play this yet. We'll see. We'll see. I personally, obviously, I don't want the little one to die. But Carl lost her memory. So I, how am I gonna play this? How am I gonna decide to play this? What? Hmm, okay. Seems like I'm having a bit of a stroke. And whatever the equivalent of an android stroke is. You hate it. You hate Alice? How dare you hate such a, a wonderful little girl? She is very tolerable for a character that is basically just a giant, um,. It's called, um, not fetch quest. Uh, um, walking a person around is basically useless. She is not, she's a, a more tolerable, not useless character. Escort mission, yes. She's just a giant escort mission and she's a tolerable escort. That's Master what I'm trying to say. Take it up to him. Yes, Luther. Remembers Luther, doesn't remember Alice.
empty. I want to peek around some more. See if I have any other uh, breaks in memory. Also, don't I still have a gun? Like, I didn't see them take the gun off me. I don't remember getting rid of the gun. Can't they just shoot him? Especially Luther. Like, that man is going... Like, if I try anything on Zlot or whatever his name was, Zvetko. I can't pronounce it. Without seeing it on screen, I don't remember what it was. What is it? It's Zlotko. That's not Zlotko. Okay. Yeah, if I, if I try anything on him, Luther's just gonna tank me. Like, he's just gonna destroy me. Any other good bits to look at? What if I just take a seat? What if I just say, no, no. I don't do any work today. God, I'm so upset with myself for sucking at this. Uh, uh, just set it down on the table over there. He killed Todd, yeah. Did you kill Todd at the beginning? I know. Yes, 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 I did kill Todd. Todd is indeed dead. I'm gonna put it down somewhere, and I can't, I'm not entirely sure where. What? For a second, I thought he just turned Alice into an android. Because I haven't seen Alice. And that's no bueno. This man's just eating, like, snacks. You have me bring the master dinner, but... Did you hear what I said? Yes, Lucky. Yeah, he does have a Todd resemblance. I joke about being annoyed with Alice a lot, but she's an essential part of, to, of to Kara's story. I'm not much of a kids person, but the way her and Kara interact throughout the story gave me lots of feels. So. Before I, before I had a kid, which I mentioned in, in the few previous streams, like, I have a kid. Before I had a kid, did not care too much for any, like, children in, in video games, movies, whatever. Luther! Like, I didn't, I didn't feel a connection with them or anything. Luther! But, like, since having a kid, I feel very connected to, to all children and whatnot. So. Have a look at the little one, see what I can do with it. Uh. Understood, Slako. I'll bring you the little one in ten minutes. Oh, I'm timed. That's not good. Zaka looks similar to Todd. Yeah, yeah, I definitely saw that after, like, the, the bit um, with the replay right there. But like I was saying, I, I feel more of a connection to, like, children in, in different movies and whatnot. Like, like the spoiler for Endgame, when when Hawkeye, like, when his family disappears, that was, like, the most feelsy part of, this, of the movie to me. Because, like, I, put, I could put myself in his shoes. I was like, oh, my God, what would I do if my kid and my wife just, like, disappeared out of nowhere? So, like, to me, that was the most feelsy part of that movie. And, um... Like this, this I like. I feel, I feel like I must protect Alice as a father. I feel like that's what I should be doing. And um, I started watching uh, Walking Dead season nine because it came on Netflix like a week ago or, or whatnot. I, like I started watching it yesterday. I binge watched like half the season already. And um, there's like uh, like third episode or something. Maggie gets like attacked from behind while she's like w has her kid in the stroller and like. She's attacking behind the kid goes like falling over and like out of the stroller and like that that like that's the most feels I've had in that show for a while because like much connection to children now being a dad and all that's all I'm trying to get at what is this what are you doing stop okay I'm just I'm gonna stop taking around I'm wasting too much time Is there anything else in here I can- Oh, there's something. I want to I wanna mess with all the things I can, but I'm also on a time limit, which kind of makes this difficult. The dog? Oh, Jesus! Big Brother Ed? Oh, oh, open the- Hell yeah! It's the doggo. Oh, wait, is that a polar bear? What is this thing? Oh, you just heard me with that FMA reference. Yeah, how could... Like, that? that's all I see right there. That is all I see right there. That's a good rule of thumb in this game to pause if you have a tangent to run off on. Ooh, then we're never going to get through this game because I have tangents all the time. Okay, I need to find where Alice is. Alice! What are you doing here? What are you doing here? 
You must always obey the master. Oh yes, you must always obey. You should not be here. Okay. You have no business here. I came here to take a big old android poopy. If you have no orders, <laughs> you should go on standby. Oh yes, you must obey. Yes, you must obey. Yes. No, not FMA references that hurt too much. I just, I didn't, didn't think anyone would actually catch that reference. <laughs> but I'm so glad that everyone did, so I'm not the only one hurting right now. All right, where is she? Oh, Jesus, Luther! I thought that you... God, he's so big! I'm sorry. About the little one. Let me in! Oh yeah, time to read a magazine. You guys know how much I love reading my magazines. Oh my god, I hate using the damn touchpad. Arctic issues. Oh, oh, that's me! That's me! For once, it was a good thing for me to read the magazine. I remember! I assumed that she was going to be in here since Luther was staying outside the door. Maybe she'll be in a different room? Luther, where the hell is she? Okay. I don't have much time left. Oh, well, I guess I still have like half my time. I'm so worried. All right. Oh, okay. Yep. Let's just take a burning log. Something over there. Oops. Turn on. Turn on. A Detroit supermarket was held up at gunpoint last night. The cashier reports that he was attacked by an android in the company of a little girl. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go check this thing. I'm gonna open that door after. What is this? Oh no, it was a door that want me to go through. No, no, I'm going through this door. Oh, I don't know where Alice is. I don't know what. God damn it! Come on, I don't know where she is, and I don't like that. Are you in here, Alice? Alice? Yes! I have located El Childe. Yes. Car, you remember me? How could I forget you? Well, he, you know, he wiped your memory and all so that. Sorry. He's a terrible right, hacker if he's unable to actually reset it. Very good. Come on. We have to you gotta replace hard drives and all that. Anyways, okay? He should know. Just erasing things still has a digital footprint. He should know that. Yo, I'm such a deviant. A deviant to the second time. Yes, love. I'm finished here. Go fetch the little one. Oh, okay. Yep. All right. That's why there's all the different doors because I have to go through different doors escaping. How do you want to play Marcus and Jericho? Will you attack or be peaceful? Um. Not go. What? The little one is gone. I'm definitely going to play him well, I can't have just disappeared. Gotta be here somewhere. as a, Go look. like, um, I don't know. Originally, I was going to play him as, like, a, a peacekeeper, but now, with the way things have gone, I think I'm going to go for more of a, not offensive, uh, aggressive, more of an aggressive character. Or he's he's going to be, like, he's going to be a freedom fighter. Connor's gonna be just a, a, a cop trying to solve everything and being being a good boy with Hank, trying to have a good rapport with Hank. And um, should I not be hiding under this table? What the fuck are you doing? Come here. Coming. <gasps> I don't have enough hands. And then her, she's obviously just trying to keep Alice safe. That's 
That's how these are all working. Yeah, I, I wouldn't consider him saying that a spoiler. Because like it's pretty clear that he like he there like something bad is gonna happen, or not? So like something something very aggressive, or like the robbery. The robbery's gonna occur, and I'm probably gonna. I mean, I want it to be, um, I want to be peaceful, but I have no issue with not being peaceful about it if that's if that's possible. That was spooky. Oh, Jesus! Go! Get out! What are you doing? Oh, just screw it. Let's go for the back door. I feel like the front door is too obvious. Oh, no, 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 Oh, God. Oh, God. I was hyping up my QTE prowess so much yesterday. And here I am just messing up so bad. Alice! Go, Alice! No! I won't leave! Oh my god, shut up, go! 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 I screwed up. I warned you. Dreams always end in tears. You should have listened to me. What are you doing? Get out of my way. No. Not this time. I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. Oh, Luther! My boy! Oh, they're all coming. Oh, amazing. Amazing. What are you doing? Who let you out? Get away from me! Get away from me! Yo, this is totally I'm Toy Story. I'm your master! He said, amazing. Yo, Luther, Luther's definitely like my second favorite NPC so far. Like Hank, then Luther. I didn't want to hurt you. He programmed me to obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, it was like opening my eyes for the first time. Finally, I could see. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the border. I could take you there. I mean, I trust him. I could protect you. If I get the option, I'll trust him. You and the little one. All right. Don't you give me the option? I trust you. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. That's totally a polar bear now. Now that I uh, see it in all its glory outside. Oh damn it! I miss stuff. I hate when I miss stuff. But there are so many options. Oh yes, the option was like go outside. I bet I bet the front door was locked. That's why I went with the um. That's why I went with the back is I feel like the front door was too obvious and would have been locked. Uh yeah, just everyone shouting Luther in the chat. Yeah, Luther, he's such a good boy. Uh no, don't hate Alice. Luther's such such a good. I love him. It's funny how he only did it because of Alice, there goes the polar bear. Yeah, so he I mean I mean it makes sense. He's seen probably dozens. Like at, at least a dozen uh, of them were there, but there are probably more that weren't still at the house anymore, so there are just dozens of androids that he's seen and had no problem doing it with. Uh, like, like, wiping the mind and everything, but, like, seeing, like, 
He probably is in his programming to put human life above, you know, non-human life and whatnot. Like, human life over android life. So seeing um, Alice in danger and then seeing her trying to protect an android, he was, that probably is what did it. Oh! Oh, I get to her Connor thing. Oh, that's interesting. Died at 1554 Parks Avenue, August 15th. Uh, T DPD, November 6th. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not the best. Not the best. Nope, damn it, didn't mean to do that. Does the bear show back up? Please tell me the bear shows back up. If he, if the bear doesn't show up, we're gonna be so sad. Hello, Amanda. Connor, I've been expecting you. Would you mind a little walk? So she... I feel like she's an android. She probably isn't, and I'm just, like, thinking too much into it, but, like... I feel like she's an android, because she's so very matter-of-a-fact. That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Pity you didn't manage to capture it. I agree. I may not be suited for this investigation. Oh, no, that's not Maybe right. you should consider replacing me. Did you manage to learn anything? Let's read the I diary. I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. What else? The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. You came very close to capturing that deviant. How is your relationship with the lieutenant developing? He seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this. Whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Oh, she's totally an android now. Now I'm now I'm down I'm I'm doubling down on it. She's an android because she was just like she blunk and she was like New cases coming, as if like she just had uploaded to her mind or whatever. 100% Android, I'm calling it. I'm putting it down. But also, I, she she reminds me of Amanda Waller for anyone who like um is a comic fan or or whatnot. She was also in Suicide Squad because that's kind of her business, is uh, running the Suicide Squad basically. Um, not a great movie, but she's she's an interesting character, and that that's like the vibe I get from her. Uh, is she's very Amanda Waller esque. Hank, friend, nice. Let's keep up this Hank goodness. Uh, I also hate when I miss stuff, but if it's any constellation, a lot of those endings are complete failures. So with a lot of those chapters not getting a complete load chart, can be a good thing. Yeah, yeah, you're right. But I just I'm a completionist, so I feel like like I'm good. Whenever I do like subsequent playthroughs, I'm gonna try and make sure I fill in all those little extra bits. I don't get who Amanda is. Is she in Connor's head or is she real? I don't really get her story. I understand it, but that spoiler, so I'll stay quiet. Text me on private, please. I really want to know it. 07. 07? What? I don't, know, I don't know what you mean by 07. Um, Lieutenant Anderson! Yeah, okay, let's just... Mr. Anderson! <laughs> I thought I thought that it would... Um, oh, 07 is a slow... Oh, okay. I was hoping that the bell would just ring until I let go, so I was just going to keep holding it. Okay, looks like we're gonna go through the bank. Oh, okay, Hank, why do you have such an awful doorbell? I mean, it could be worse. It could be, like, one of those really obnoxious, like, song doorbells. But, I mean, it's good the first time, but then I can just go hit it hit it constantly, and then I just, we just hear the little drummer boy on repeat for hours, because that's all I'm gonna be doing is just mashing the doorbell. Is there a way through the... Ba oh, no, didn't mean to go up the stairs. The way through the back, maybe? Sort of through the side or whatnot? He passed out? Or is that a dog? I can't really... 
Oh no, it's a dog. I see his legs. Okay. Big old doggo. Cat dog. Cat dog. Oh yeah, no. The <laughs> he's drunk. He definitely looks like he's breathing. No, don't break his window. Don't break the window. Also, I seem like I'm dropping frames and we'll wait a second before I do anything. Okay, seems to have picked back up. Alright. Yeah! <laughs> He's gonna be so mad that you broke his window, Connor. Easy sumo. Oh! Your friend. It's a beautiful Bernard. I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. What is what's the name of Beethoven? Beethoven. Got a good old Beethoven going on. Can I get a... Oh, I wanted to pet him. See, personally, I'm not a very big dog person, but dogs in video games, since I don't have to smell them, smells my big issue with dogs, and they also feel greasy to me personally. Now I'm going to get all the hate for saying I just like dogs, but... Uh, like, whenever I see a doggo in video games or movies, like, I, I can connect with those. I'm fine with that. I don't like dogs in person, though. <laughs> so I, 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 I want to love this dog so much. Uh, traces of alcohol, scotch, whiskey, 40% alcohol content. Everyone has their preferences. It's okay. I'm so, I'm so glad that I just haven't lost the entirety of the stream with that. Heart rate regular. Slight arrhythmia, no signs of trauma. Yeah, the man's just drunk. He's passed out, Connor. Like, I, would, I did not want to break through the window. It's not that big of a deal. Oh, Jesus! It is that big of a deal! What was he doing? Was he... <laughs> Jesus Christ! Lieutenant! <laughs> oh, okay, it's didn't me, really... <laughs> Slap! Slap him! Keep slapping him! Do the Deadpool thing from his game. I, I hate you. I love you. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. <laughs> get the fuck out of my house. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, I love Hank so much more now. <laughs> he sounds like the Hulk. Shut up. Attack. Good job. <laughs> Good job. Fuck, I think I'm gonna be sick. Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. Come on, Lieutenant. I'm not grumpy, I just don't like you. <laughs> I don't want a bath. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. <laughs> I mean, in all actuality, that would probably hurt like a mofo. And probably shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> we could break his spot. <laughs> I'm sorry, Luther. You have nothing on Hank. A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <sighs> Turn it off! Turn Jesus it off! Must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> Can't you just leave me alone? Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. I don't give a shit about your goddamn case. Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here! I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. Someone say, you know, club? probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. Did someone say, a place with alcohol? Uh, I'm in, in it. I'll go get them. Oh, I want to go through his unmentionables. No? Yeah, I can't go through his toiletries and whatnot. Got to get pants on the ground. Pants on the ground, looking like a fool with his pants on the ground. 
Um, damn, I really just want to like search through his underwear drawer, see all see all the Hank little bits that he doesn't want to know about. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Strippy, streaky, hippie. Hmm. Oh, stripy, not strippy. Um. I think streaky is more more Hank style. I'm granted these are all his clothes, so he probably doesn't care, but streaky sounds very Hank to me. Are you all right, Lieutenant? <coughs> yeah, yeah. <sighs> Wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. President Warren issued an official warning to Russia in her speech to Congress. We got food? Oh, records. That was a pizza box. Michigan Brothers Detroit Soul Records Autumn Blues. But this is clearly a new escalation in the complex. Hank loves jazz. Many experts are suggesting All right. I'm actually not surprised by that. Not surprised that he's a jazz man. World War draws closer every day. Hank loves jazz. Even more information about him loving jazz. There we go. Hank likes metal music and jazz music. Nice combo. Neither of those surprise me. Neither of those surprise me. Anything else in here besides doggo? Can I just like keep petting doggo for five minutes? Give me five minutes. All right, I'll go be petting doggo. What was he snacking? Oh, there's the pizza box. I'd love to pet Sumo for five minutes. <laughs> yeah, no, but again, I feel like I feel like with my my the way I feel about dogs, I think petting him and I around for five minutes, like I would just be like covered in hair and I'd feel so gross after. Is that him? Oh. Sad. Real sad. Can all of these, like, choose your, choose your own adventure games? I wish they were all, like, exist in the same universe. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Want to see how long I can last? Must have collapsed before I found out. You were lucky. The next shot would have killed you. you no, know, it would just be awesome to see like. Oh, he's ready. It'd be awesome to see like the cop from um, Heavy Rain like appear in here. Be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. It's made by the same company, right? I'd assume these are all made by the same company. All right, I think we'll go through one more section and call that a stream. So, I planned on finishing. I planned on ending the stream after this, but I thought that the section was gonna go a little bit longer. So instead, we're gonna go one more section, then call it a stream. This is all. Ha There's so much happening on November sixth. Con Connor alone has done so much. He died, was remade, and has done like two or three cases all in one day. Oh, I thought that was Kara. I was like, why is Kara climbing up right now? Like, what is going on? This is crazy. If they catch us, we're dead. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. Okay, so I'm gonna try to do this peacefully and sneakily. If it turns out that I have to murder some some bitches, it's gonna happen. I'm I'm gonna feel a little remorseful about it. Uh but like that's just how, that's how that's how Marcus is. They've they've turned him into Don't let them see us. a a radical.
Watch out. Now what do I do? I'll find another way. It probably would have been better if they didn't have four people. Like, I, the more people you bring... Like, I, th I think three would have been the perfect number. I think, I think... So, like, like it starts to go up. Like, your likelihood of success goes up the more people you bring. Like, going by yourself, you might you might miss some things. So, so, like, two people, your chances rise. I think at three people, your chances peak. And then after that, like, it starts dropping a little. I think the Andrews can communicate over radio waves. Very useful for this. Oh, were they not just talking? Because actually, that is super useful. I am so slow. Like, they are so ahead of me right now. Cyber life. Marcus, climb up here. I'm working on it, North. Androids would be so loud. Like, that, that noise, there'll be metal on metal. Like, I don't think... I don't know, maybe I'm just picturing the way that these androids are actually built incorrectly, but they should be so loud right now with all the things. That, like, this should be metal on metal playing. The warehouse is up ahead. We're almost there. Like, I would have assumed these androids are way more durable. Like, the things they're made out of would be more, way more durable than they've shown to be thus far in the game. Cyberlife warehouses. They have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. Leave it to me. But just shoot it. Bang! Got him. Are you gonna run and jump? You're insane. Oh, pre okay. Oh my god. He's gonna do the hardcore parkour. This man's insane. No, I'm thinking. Go up this way. Markor. I like it. I like it. Oh, I missed it. Compute! Compute in! Alright, let's do this! Hardcore Markor! Oh, 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 oh! You okay? There's literally a person yeah, standing, fine. like, right over there. Good job, Marcus. Like, right behind us is basically where they were standing. I don't know why Open the other crates they don't know what just happened. Take as much as you can. I was trying to figure out what crates I was going to be able to search, because they're probably searching different ones. Trespassing on private property. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. John! God damn machine! Where is it this time? Grab and hide. John! I need your help. John! I'm, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try and be sneaky. First the drone, now this. Whew. Just my luck. Let's finish up and get out of here. Yep, let's be quick. We still don't have enough. Well, 
What the hell was just spinning in the background over there? Was there something spinning in the air? Check the bigger crate. Oh. Ooh, that's a big boy crate. Let's see what's in there. Climb! Swing! Swing! What do we got? What is in there? Oh! Those aren't Connor. Why aren't you like us? Don't you want to be free? Free them. I don't know if this was a good idea. And that's all we can carry. Oh, his name's Josh. Okay, so I got some more rep repertoire. Pshha! Take me with you. He's on their side. We can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring them back with us. It's too dangerous. They come with us. I know where you can find more spare parts. What do you mean? The trucks. They're full of bio components. They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Like, I totally understand how how it's a good idea to not bring them with us. But, there, the A, he, he could help, which he just did. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. B. Oh, this is suicide, Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. A That's a good point. Spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, oh. our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. I don't know. Oh, man. Yeah. Wait here. If I'm not back in 10 minutes, go without me. Marcus. I'm coming with you. No, I'm going alone. I was going to say, it's a good idea for him to go alone. Our lives. He should have left the bag with them and be like, yo, here, have this bag. You guys go back. I'll go do handle this. What was I saying, though? Yeah, so I'm, again, I'm playing this like he is, he is a radical now. Like, after what's happened to him, he has become a radical. And doing this is the radical thing to do. Being like this. Oh, what the hell is that? Like this is the most sneaky way. Yeah. You'll live north. Yeah, she'll live. She'll get over it. I'm doing this for our people. Oh, yeah. They don't like storms. Yeah, the difference between Marcus and Connor and Chiru, no. Connor do breaks it, runs through, like it jumps a face first through it. Marcus, do slip it. Real, real solid hardcore parkour. This so. Yeah, find the key. Ooh, is it over there? Is still in zone four? Ready. Like yes, that's what I need. Done already. Better off in here than out patrolling that. Cause a blackout? Heck yes. Uh, or, oh, what's over here? I gotta figure out all my options first. Take. I don't know what this is about, but I'm definitely gonna take it. More things I have in my arsenal, the better. Oh, oh, put back, put back. I'm not gonna. Hold on. I wanna see all my options before I start just jabbing things. No, I'll go for the blackout. Or 
I feel this is gonna be really loud. Oh, can I just open it? Cool. I thought I was gonna smash it open. Just start. Yeah. Shit. What's going on? This is mine now, friend. Running, running, running. Yeah, I got skills. What are you gonna do about it? Did you get it? Nice. What are the three dudes that are up there? Oh, they're there. Just huddled. <laughs> That's so weird. They're just like huddled down there, like, it's okay. Do I have to go in here, maybe? Yeah, okay. Graceful, yeah. See, I'm good at some some things. There are things I am terrible at. Insert key. It was fast I've seen someone retrieve the key. Re really? That seemed like a really, really easy thing to do. But I guess kill killing the guards, threatening the guards, I think like that would have been a more taxing process. Again, like, I'm a radical that's trying not to kill people, but I don't have to. Like, I, I will, I'm trying to free as many people as I can in the most peaceful way. If it resorts to violence, that's fine. I'll roll resort to violence. Did they let me out, or am I still waiting here? Okay, cool. Uh, I returned, Steven Jackson. Good to see you. To be honest, that's my favorite way to play Mark is violence only as last resort if nothing else is working. Yeah. Everybody. We couldn't have done it without Marcus. I came to Jericho because here androids are free. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. Free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never gonna come. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile, or love, or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows that I am more than what they say. I am alive, and they're not going to take that from me anymore. Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we take. We are people. We are alive. We are free. How can I help? <laughs> <laughs> All right. That was real solid, real solid good stuff. And it's a great stream where we got to play a, a, de a decent bit for each person. Um, but like I said, those would be the last section I did before ending the stream, because I gotta go and take care of a baby baron! A little baby boy. But I'll read the chat and chat a bit before getting off, so let's see. Uh, Marcus got some moves. Yeah, really, Marcus a savage. Great job, graceful. I return. Good to see you again, Stephen Jackson. I do remember you. There were a lot of people. So it's hard to remember every person, but I do recognize the name. And the people who have been coming back stream after stream, I definitely recognize you guys. You guys are... You guys are in the forefront of my mind when I jump on the stream. Um, that was the fastest I've seen someone retrieve the key. Uh, to be honest, it's my favorite part to play Marcus. How did I? I swear I already read all those. Um, I don't you remember you as part of the counter raid? Yes. I do. Me too. 
So it was I uh, good to see you again. Yes, I assume most of the people that he are here watching are here from that Connor raid. And like I said, statistically, a lot of people ain't gonna jump on. Like, like I had 500 people there. I'm not gonna have 500 people every time. But this this little this little group that has stayed, I appreciate you so very much for uh, continuing to come and watch the streams. And people like Steven Jackson that that don't aren't watching each one, but jump on from here from time to time. You are also greatly appreciated. Anyone who watches my streams, albeit for any amount of time, completely appreciated. Um. Still trying to set everything up on the Twitch channel. Uh, I'm glad I got to know you from the raid. You're doing such a cool run so far. I've seen stuff I haven't seen before, and it's cool. That's awesome. I'm I'm so happy to know that I'm playing this very originally. Because <laughs> um, I, I, I don't know. I really like these games. And um, I don't. when I finish this game, I'm probably going to go back, do, like, different things. But I think I'm going to... Um, I think after I finish the game and do... And I'm kind of happy with... With how I've done the game and done a little bit of backtracking to do some other parts. I think we're going to jump on and do like the other. D tell me if I'm wrong, but Heavy Rain and, um, oh my god, what's the other one? Uh, there's, there's like the horror one and there's the ghost one. I can't, um, Beyond Two Souls. Like these are all made by the same people, right? So think about going back and playing all those because I've, I've played Heavy, Heavy Rain all the way through multiple times. I've played part of Beyond Two Souls and there's the other one that's like in a forest or something. And there's like a murderer or something or like that. Those are all made by the same people people quantum quantic dream games okay yeah so i'm gonna think i'm gonna go back and play a bunch of those because uh, i never played heavy rain nor have i watched anyone play it well you're definitely gonna see it if you stick around after this is over because i love heavy rain actually it was like the first thing that i think i had streamed a full playthrough of was heavy rain it was the very first game that i played all the way through on my channel so actually if you have an interest in going back and seeing how i used to be you know years ago even though i like, I don't, I don't have a lot of followers, but I've been doing this for a while now. If you have over to my YouTube, which I finally linked down below uh, in the, the little panel bit. I don't know the words for things. Um, but they'll, uh, you can you can hop on over to my YouTube, and if you look at my Heavy Rain stuff, I think I have a playlist up, and if I don't, I'll, I'll make a playlist, because I have to get around to doing all that. It's like nine parts. Really great game. Uh, one, of my, one of my favorite games of all time, Heavy Rain. It's amazing. Uh, once I get a job, I'm going to get all three, since they'll probably be all out on a PC by then. Still waiting for Detroit. Oh, cool. Let's take a look. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate that. Um, and there's the other one. What is the other one? Um, it's going to bother me if I can't remember the name of it. Well, what did you say? Well, like Quantic Dream Games. Uh, I want to... I wanna, I, it's going to bother me if I can't remember the name of this. New Window. I'm pretty sure I have all of, all of like their games because they've been all free at one time or another on PlayStation Plus, which is where I'm playing this on, if you guys didn't realize. Um, Quantic... Dream Games. Beyond Two Souls, Heavy Rain. Did they not make the other one I'm thinking of? I seriously can't remember the name. Maybe Telltale made it, and that's why I think. But Telltale games are great, too. I may just start doing all these choose, choose your own adventure games, because I, I like that. it's such a great genre. Um, Games developed. Detroit Heavy Rain. Oh, they didn't make that. What is the game I'm thinking of? I know there's a v there was like a VR sequel. I thought it was a choose-your-own-adventure kind of game like this. Uh, Fahrenheit, Indigo Prophecy. No, so I, ju I just looked at their games, and it's not under... They have five games they've made. Nomad, Soul, Fahrenheit, Heavy Rain, Beyond Two Souls, and Detroit are the five games that Wikipedia says they made. Those are not the games I'm thinking of. I, I want to say it starts with a U. Hold on. I'm pretty sure I have it downloaded. We're going to look at all the millions of games I have real quick as I go to look for this game. I don't think I have it downloaded, though. Let's see. Let's look through all these games real quick. Not Beyond Two Souls. There's a VR, ver like a VR sequel. I know I have that. Because that's free. Um. Oh my, it's going to bother me that I don't remember what this is. Kung Fu, but since we do have a Kung Fu Panda game, what is this? Um. God, it's, it's bothering me so much I can't remember this right now. It's it's a game, like, I'm pretty sure you're, like, a bunch of friends. You go out into, like, you go to, like, a cabin in the woods, and there's, like, like someone, like, one, like, you guys don't know what's going, like, you don't know what's behind it. <laughs> I don't know. There was a Kung Fu Panda game. Yeah, I know, right? Honestly, I feel, yeah, it bothers me when I can't remember something. So, like, so you a bunch of friends, you go to the a cabin in the woods. I'm not seeing it here anywhere. Um, but like one, it turns out that I know that I know by a little spoilers that one of the people that you're with until dawn, until dawn, I do have until dawn. 
I thought I thought until dawn was made by the same people. Who makes until dawn? I I haven't played this yet, but I was under the impression it was similar to them. Super massive games. Do they do similar games? Who super massive games? What games do they make? Oh, they make Little Big Planet. No, they don't. They made it one DLC for Little Big Planet. Never mind. Don't listen to me. No, they do make what? Do they make Little Big Planet or not? I see a bunch of Little Big Planets on their uh, games developed thing. Uh, Little Big Planet, Little Big Planet Two, Little Big Planet PS Vita, they, but they didn't make three. I'm very confused. Hey, who made Little Big Planet? No, they did not make Little Big Planet. Okay. I was gonna say that didn't sound like the right people. But what did they make? They made Little Big Planet DLC for basically all the games. Big Match, Striker, Tumble, Start the Party, Sackboy's Prehistoric Move, Start the Party, Save the World, Little Big Planet 2, Doctor Who, The Eternity Clock, Killzone HD, Walking with Dinosaurs, Little Big Planet, PS Vita, Until Dawn, Until Dawn, Rush of Blood, Tumble VR, Hidden Agenda, The Inpatient, Bravo Team... Di These games do not seem like Until Dawn to me. But yeah, Until Dawn was the one I was thinking of. Uh, okay... Yeah, they do. Their newest game in the style is Man of Medan. Medan. I don't know how to pronounce that, but that's not on their on their list of games they made. But I don't I don't disbelieve you. Ha ha ha. I just googled friends in cabin in the woods video game and found it was until dawn at the same time you found it. Okay. Yeah, I, I know I know one spoiler. I think like one of the people they're with like is the killer and then it turns out there's like something more going on after like that's I think you that's an early reveal you find that out. Maybe I just spoiled the end of the game for myself and everyone watching, in which case I'm very sorry, but it is like a four four or five year old game. So I don't when I accidentally spoil things that are old, I don't feel particularly horrible, but um anyway guys, I think that's gonna be it for this stream. I'm trying to find my way back to Detroit. Yeah, I think this, that's gonna be it for the stream. I hope you guys have all enjoyed this. Um for the people that are watching this on playback over on YouTube, because I'm gonna be I have the recording set. I'm going to upload that uh, tomorrow at some point because Twitch's rules. Today I have 24 exclusivity or 24 hour exclusivity or whatever. I'm going to try and record and upload all my streams on over to uh, YouTube the day after. Which actually might be a really good way for me to keep up content over on YouTube because I was worried about. I'm always worried about my YouTube content, but now that I'm kind of just kind of sticking with Twitch streams specifically, I'm hoping that will work itself out but in any case uh if you guys are watching over on youtube leave a like if you enjoyed subscribe for all that good shit hit the notification bell so you don't miss the stream or an upload i will catch you guys in the next one and peace